By 7 a.m., voting had kicked off in most polling stations since the voting material was dispatched as early as 4 a.m. Unlike other by-elections, Bukimpiri that has 72 polling stations showed a high voter turnout. Uh, the turn up is okay, everything is going on, people are coming, they are voting and going, there's no problem. Uh, this morning very early by 7, people had started voting on different polling stations. They were calm, you could see people trickling in from different parts of the hills, coming down and going up to vote, and the exercise is generally going on well. I, I can see the turn up is much, meaning that people are expecting to really cast their vote and the, at the end of the day we shall... Be, we shall see the winner. I... NRM's Ed Quizera voted at Iremera Health Unit polling station in Nyanamo Town Council, where he accused his closest opponent of fearing voters from neighboring districts. After completing the, the campaign program, we embarked on planning yesterday, and so far, uh, in only this sub county where there was supposed to be some intruders from Kabali and Rubanda who are coming here, but generally everywhere is okay, everything is going on well. While an NRM leaning independent candidate as Gario Turiadzenda voted at Ndungamo Primary School polling station and also accused the Quizera's team of intimidation and voter bribery. Everything has gone very well, but I have got some information from different polling stations, like at the Sofu polling station in Nyortembe, there have been some vehicles which have got LRDCs there and the number plates are recovered in oil. You cannot know which vehicle is which one and the information I have, they are trying to see how they can, they can rig the election. While the FDC candidate James Webe voted at Nyamirama polling station, he pledged to run back to court if the process is not free and fair. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of commerce. There's a lot of commerce in this election. They're giving out a lot of money. The voting ended at 4 p.m. and vote counting started thereafter where the race is tight between the incumbent MP Eddie Quizera and an independent candidate as Gario Turiadzenda. Results will be declared by the Electoral Commission either in the evening or early in the morning on Friday. Philip Aguta, UBC News in Xoro.